Hi Star, this is a video for you at your request, basically for uh, beginner uh, finger picking. The reason why finger picking is uh, so easy is because it's natural, you don't need to learn to play with a pick or any other gizmo, it's just use your fingers. Most people that do finger picking on a regular basis have long fingers. I usually play with the pick so I have very short fingers. I'll be playing with the skin instead of with the, the nail. It sounds more smooth with the nail. N more smooth with the skin than with the nails, basically. Uh, all rules are meant to be broken, of course, but the basic rules are that you use these three fingers here and the thumb. The thumb will be uh, fretting or picking the uh, top three notes, top three strings. You know, the bigger ones. And the three of the fingers will be most of the time picking the three last ones, one, two, three, like this here. You just basically put your hand like this and assume a normal position on the guitar. Take a simple, you know, D chord like this, just a normal D chord, okay? And you're basically gonna use your thumb to uh, do the open D string, and every other finger, see, one, two, three, in that order, basically, just pluck the string. Not too hard, or not too soft, just get a normal sound, like this. And a really simple exercise for you would be basically to um, get, you know, thumb, one, two, three, and then back, back up again, so thumb, one, two, three. I highly recommend you do this with a metronome or with a beat, if you have any type of beat machine, just a simple beat like this. And go. Now there are a lot of different techniques out there, you know, classical playing and all that type of stuff and all that. You know, just get something that's comfortable for you, just so you don't feel too awkward. Just get for for me, it's more like a tight fit like this. It just seems to fit better, like just better like this. So just try to get a feel where what type of curve you want to get to get a good plucking sound uh, with your fingers. So that's basically like the first thing you would like to do. Then you would like to invert, inverse the process. So instead of going thumb and finger one, two, three, you want to go thumb and then three, two, one, like this. So a lot of songs you will hear this in a lot of songs. So just take again the simple D major chord and go like this. Again, you want to do this on time, absolutely, so to take a metronome or a beat. If you don't have one, go get one. Or this is, I think it's metronome, metronomeonline.com in one word. You have a free click there, just use it. It goes like this. If that's too fast, you just lower the beat. Just lower it. And go. That was your second exercise. The first one is like this. That'll be pretty easy. Now, uh, what you could also do, you keep the same interval between your thumb and your fingers, but you just do the same thing on everything one string higher.